Say goodbye to punctuation problems in complex sentences. Hello, language learners. Today, we are going to explore one of the critical components of English writing, which is punctuation in complex sentences. Our focus will be on understanding the common errors we often make and learning how to avoid them. Let's jump right in. First, let's quickly recap what a complex sentence is. A complex sentence contains one independent clause and at least one dependent clause. For instance, while I was eating, the cat scratched at the door. While I was eating, is the dependent clause, and, the cat scratched at the door, is the independent clause. The key to punctuating complex sentences correctly is understanding where to place your commas, which is often between the independent and dependent clauses. Here are some of the most common punctuation errors made in complex sentences. 1. Placing commas in the wrong location. For example, the cat scratched at the door, while I was eating. Here the comma isn't required, because the sentence starts with the independent clause. 2. Missing commas. For instance, while I was eating the cat scratched at the door. The comma is missing after eating. 3. Adding unnecessary commas. For example, while I was eating, the cat scratched at the door. The comma after while is not needed. Now, how can we avoid these errors? It's simpler than you might think. 1. Correct comma placement. If the sentence begins with a dependent clause, use a comma to separate it from the independent clause. No comma is needed when the sentence begins with an independent clause. 2. Avoid unnecessary commas. Only use commas to separate independent and dependent clauses, or to indicate a pause in the sentence. 3. Always proofread. After writing your sentence, take a moment to proofread it. Check if your commas are placed correctly and if you have missed any. And there you have it, folks. By understanding the structure of complex sentences and the rules of punctuation, you can avoid common errors. Remember, practice makes perfect, so keep writing and keep learning. We hope this video has been helpful to you in your journey to mastering English punctuation in complex sentences. Until next time, keep practicing.